Yeah, hi, good morning. This is Rajesh Palwa from the Technical Days. I just take you through the Nifty as well as the USD and a technical view for the day. In the last trading session, Nifty opened on a flat note and witnessed the high volatility throughout the session. Nifty moved in the both the direction, but however, in the last hour, there was buying interest seen in the market and Nifty closed with a gain of 16 point compared to the previous trading session at 8743 level. So, uh, so Nifty has formed a bullish candlestick pattern with a long lower shadow indicating that there is a buying interest at the lower level. As we indicated earlier also that 8700, 8710 are the important support area on the Nifty for any kind of corrective action. And still we believe that uh, market should uh, take support from these level and we may see the higher level of 8780 or 8800 uh, in coming trading session. Once the Nifty crosses this 8800-8830 level, then again Nifty would be in the comfort zone on the buying side and the fresh buying will uh, emerge in the market and Nifty can scale up from those level to 8900 or 8950 in coming weeks in the short term. So uh, 8700 is a buying opportunity for near term trader and we suggest and uh, as the Nifty is holding its all important moving averages and uh, indicators for the short term charts are also in the positive territory. So we believe that uh, the short term uh, trend would remain as a positive side and one should be on the buy side whenever the dips comes in the market. Uh, for, for, for the uh, uh, lower side 8700 and 8650 are likely to act as a support for any kind of minor or major corrective action in the near term or in the short term basis. Uh, for the day 8735 is the important level to watch for if nifty holds and crosses above this level then 8760, 8780, 8810 are the uh, resistance area for intraday basis. If nifty breaks below 8735 level then uh, some profit booking again may witness and 8715, 8685 are the levels, uh, lower levels we can witness in the uh, during the day. Now moving to the stocks front, positive bias stocks for the day are Reliance Industry, DV's Lab, PEL, Bhail, Exide Industry, Sun TV and Tabar. Negative bias stocks for the day are Titan, Hero Motor Corp, Apollo Hospital, Reliance Infant, PNB. Now moving to the USDNR view. Uh, in the last trading session, USDNR opened on a flat note and remained uh, in very narrow range. It was very lackluster kind of uh, movement we have seen in the USDNR and closed at 67.13 level. So on the daily chart, USDNR has formed a, a bullish, bullish candlestick pattern and with the carrying the uh, either side shadow indicating that there is an indecisiveness among the participant and a lack of strength in the uh, USDNR. So since uh, past 3-4 trading session, USDNR is consolidating in a range of 66.90 to 67.30. This is the range of last 3-4 days. So uh, we believe that uh, as the short term charts are in the bearish territory and uh, still uh, it's trading below its 20 DMA and 50 DMA uh, moving average. So suggesting that uh, there is a, a bearish sentiment in the short to medium term basis in the USDNR. And the preferred strategy would be whenever it reaches to the resistance area near to resistance area is a shortening opportunity in the USDNR. One can remain short in the USDNR. Broadly, one can keep a stop loss of 67.50 uh, as a positional short stop loss. And for trader, uh, once the US dollar reaches to the level of 67.2025 level, is a shorting opportunity with stop loss of uh, 67.3035. Thank you.